Okay folks, it's me again and in today's video we are going to install macOS Sonoma Beta 7 and I know I've done this video before but someone in the comment section asked me to do it from a Windows end since they say that I did it on Sonoma on macOS so see this guy says bro you are using a mac what about the pc so today's video is about just that so we'll just get started the first thing first you need to do have the requirement and as all my other videos you know the drill first you need to download the balena etcher which we will use to create the image files to be bootable and then second thing you need to have explorer plus plus and the third thing you need to have the image i'll leave all the link in the in the video description below so you can download them at your inconvenience so let's go as you can see i've just created i'm in the process of creating my bootable usb but the drill is just the same straightforward i'll just show you i'll let this one finish and then come back when it's done so that we can continue from there so let me pause the video and then i'll come back when the flashing is done also one thing before i go you need to have the, the efi that support your your system and you can just find your system on the properties you can see here mine is intel core i3 6100 so you can know the code name of your so if i paste this on google and then search the first link you can just click it and then you'll know the code name of your cpu so as you can see mine here is Kylek, the code name. So after that you can just, if you know how to create your own EFI, you can follow the Dotania guide. But also in Olaria you can get the pre-made EFI folders after you have just find your code name you can just come here to the efi folder that is if you don't know how to make your own efi so you can just come here and then just choose your open code for desktop you can just choose as you can see for mine it's kylek but i've already created mine yeah so but if you don't know how to create one or you are follow the, this guide and you are stuck somewhere you can just come here and download from this so with that said let's wait for this one to finish with the flashing and then we can continue from there Okay folks, so our flashing is done and as you can see here uh, it says Olarida Sonoma Beta 7 row completed. So let's close this one. So the next thing is where the Explorer Plus Plus come comes in. So let me just pull it to the desktop right there. So also you need the mini tool partition. Also, I'll leave a link in the description below. So let me launch the mini tool partition and let's find our this is our so normal bootable USB. So let me just change the letter and then hit on yes. Okay. And just close that one 
so we can see we have assigned the letter H to our EFI so if you go to this PC you can see these are our EFI but if you try to open it you cannot you don't have any permission so that's where Explorer plus plus come comes in here so let me close this one run open Explorer plus plus as an admin sorry and then you can see this is our EFI here we can access it from here so delete the one that comes with the Olarilla Sonoma and then let's go to our tools and let me just ex extract So let me just copy this one like so and then come here paste it and that one is done guys so that means this bootable usb is ready to boot the mac os or normal beta 7 on my skylake rig so i'll go i'll go to the to my phone and then we can continue with the installation process so let me just close all this one and then i'll see you on the next one so everything is ready let me just hit on f12 and then select my USB hit enter and then choose uh, install Mac OS or normal beta enter let's wait for it so there we go I have the loading bar down here you can see right here and the mouse cursor also so there, we, there it is all right so the drill is just the same just like always click on and then enter boot disk utility show all devices I'll just erase that one I'll call it Macintosh Sonoma HD and format it to APFS and then scheme is GID partition map erase so after that is done click on done close disk utility install Sonoma continue 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 agree select the hard disk or SSD that we have just formatted continue and then there we go I'll just pause the video and come back when this one is done let's just restart it again this time choose the Mac OS installer and then hit enter and then we'll go to 29 minutes remaining
There we go. So again, I'll pause the video and come back when it's done. So the machine is just restarted and now you can see it has booted from Macintosh SHD. So we are almost there. Let's wait for the next phase where we will set up our Mac. Come on, focus. Right, so let's continue. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let me choose my my region and then continue. Let me just let's remove that one. Continue. Out now. Continue. Not now. Agree. Now, add in your name. You go with. I keep key in your password verify it continue Let's wait for it to create our account. It's taking long. There we go. Continue. Don't use. Just choose your. Continue. Set up later. Enable Siri or disable. Let's go with your preference. Then let me just choose the dark mode. Continue. And there you go, guys. Our new Mac OS Sonoma. As you can see right here. Let me just go to about this Mac. There you go. We have our iMac. So now if we go to more info. You can see this is the build number 23A5337A. So that's it. So the last thing we need to do, we need to copy the EFI from the USB to the 
partition to the SSD partition. So I'm gonna do just that. Let me just copy this one. Let me mount my EFI. Okay. So I'll just mount the SSD and also I'll mount the USB. So they're both open, just close this one. So this is the EFI for the USB. Just copy this one. Come right here to the one on the let's move it to trash paste the new EFI and that's it for this video guys we are just booted our Mac OS or normal beta 7 step by step guide so that's it for this video and I'll see you on the next one peace